Hi, my name is Bethel Bolina, and I'm a student at Athens Drive High School, and I'm talking with Bernice James, one of the Wake County Trailblazers. Um, okay, so you were one of the first black students to integrate to a Wake County school. Yes, South Wake and County. So what school did you attend? Fuqua High School. What was it like? It was different. Um, after leaving the consolidated schools, which was the segregated school, um, the challenge was there, or was curiosity more than anything. Um, it was different. Um, it was a, and then the, just thinking that it was going to be good because when I work with people outside of the school, you know, you work in, in the farm or work somewhere, and you thought everybody was the same, but it was totally different when I got to the school. Um. Why was this important for you to do it? I can't say it was important, but it was just that um, the, they needed somebody to go, and I always liked to be the first to volunteer, not realizing what I was getting myself into. <laughs> and now I see that it was important. Mm -hmm. um, how did this affect you going to an all-white school? The first year, it affected me very much. Not to the place where I might have gotten the PTSD, the post-traumatic uh, stress syndrome, but it was it was very it was difficult. Um, you know the name calling, some of the you know bullying, not that much bullying, but riding the school bus. When you ride the school bus, they shoot you with rubber bands, and back then we wore closer haircuts, and you turn around and look and see who did it, and nobody, you know, everybody was calm. Yeah. So it, it it affected me to a certain extent, which made me stronger, I think, to this day. Um. How did this integration affect your family? It didn't per se because I didn't share much with them and I think with my family uh, we were sort of close but they I think my mom pretty much wanted me to do what was best for me because when, at younger age 14 15 or a little earlier in age you were you were grown you were just about grown <laughs> and because I was working on my own I was getting my own clothes and it didn't I don't think it affected them and I didn't want them to be affected because I didn't want them to know how did this help you with your career as being a police officer? Well, uh, and it's good that you said that. Uh, it really helped me a lot. Uh, being a police officer, and not necessarily that's the reason I came on the police department, but I was a school resource officer for 16 years. And I still work at one of the uh, highest, most, most prominent uh, private schools to this day uh, as a um, security manager. But it helped me because when I see somebody getting bullied, I can set them down and I can relate to what they're telling me. Okay. Um, thank you, Bernice James, for being a Wake County Trailblazer, and thank you for what you have done. For thank you very much for inviting me. I really enjoyed it.